when we first started the firm, it was in February of 1986. We started out with a law firm of one, and that was me. And about two months later, I was able to hire an associate who I worked with at my former law firm. And our goal was to specialize in a certain area, become the very best. We've gone from one attorney to 42 attorneys. You really built the law firm brick by brick. Preparation and focus and dedication to the client are really some of the things that have really made us successful over the years. To not be prepared is a cardinal sin in the practice of law. Sean Flaherty is now our managing partner. He's one of the few attorneys that comes with a complete picture. I grew up in a middle class family. While I was in college, I worked for the union that my dad was in. I was able to work on construction projects like Gillette Stadium. I was at work. I was doing some work on a light that was being installed. I was about 30 feet in the air. Unfortunately, the lift wasn't positioned correctly, and as a result, the bucket I was in tipped over with me in it. I had fractures of just about all the bones in my left foot and had implementation of screws and hardware that actually are still there to this day. Fortunately, I was able to meet George Ketches. He represented me because of the hard work that George did for me as an injured worker. I decided to devote my life to helping other people and other injured workers like me. My husband was a laborer for a company. We were high school sweethearts. We had a baby boy, we got married, we had our baby girl, and like we had our fairy tale. It was a Friday morning in the summer. I remember getting breaking news on my phone that there was um, a trench accident in Longmeadow and that a worker was trapped. And I remember thinking, oh my gosh, that's awful. I got a call from the Longmeadow Police Department. They asked me to come to the station. I walked in and there were a few police officers. They told me he was gone. And my whole life just shattered. I was so angry because he and I had had some conversation about some of the workplace safety issues that existed. And I said, I need someone who's gonna really fight for me. Ketch's Law was so compassionate. I talked to Sean and he just put my mind at ease and I truly felt like he wasn't just my lawyer, but he was a friend. He had my back. This awful thing happened to me, but he's like, you're gonna be okay and I'm gonna make sure those kids are okay. We wanna drive the best, bar none, result for our client. I would hope that my personal legal legacy would be one in which I am able to help through the law the people that helped raise me outside the law. We're in a service industry. We've changed a lot of lives by doing a good job. You know, life is not finished because the case is finished and the relationship continues.